the biggest thing uh, is uh, appointment-based admissions for owner surrenders. Um, while that has been going on for over a year now, um, it's something that we do want the public to realize that uh, there is a little bit of a wait. We do ask um, that you do certain things like attempt to rehome your animal. We will give you resources. Uh, there's also resource availability if you need um, food, maybe a tether. Uh, we do have that available, which will enable um, the pet owner to keep the pet itself. There's actually several reasons. First of all, it is to maintain um, a safe and healthy population at the shelter. However, it's also to make sure that we are serving the community and having the best outcome for the animals that are surrendered here. So if we're full, uh, you know, it is, I'm, I'm just gonna say it, euthanasia levels do go up. So if we can manage the actual population here, we have a better outcome for the animal that is going to be surrendered. We have a fantastic group of animals here. I mean, the population, uh, you got smalls, mediums, puppies, anything you're pretty much looking for, we got it. Um, so I would say keep an open mind, um, kind of see which pet you're really, really attracted to, what that bond is, and you know, just know that, um, you know, it's, Pets are our responsibility, so keep that in mind as well. I just want to let people know we're here 12 to 5, um, Monday through Saturday. We're here to help. We're a resource. Embrace the shelter. The shelter is embracing the community. So if we work together, I think that the outcomes for whether it is an adoption or you know whether it is keeping that animal with you, um, I think a lot of positive outcomes are, are going to be present.